Inside Gaming is brought to you by ExpressVPN. Why haven't you gotten a VPN yet? Go to expressvpn.com slash inside. Oh, hello there gamers, you're probably just waking up bright and early to see what Santa left under that tree. But you know, Christmas almost didn't happen, and if it weren't for a little YouTube channel called Inside Gaming, there wouldn't be nothing under that tree at all. Uh, <laughs> anyone have any good ideas of what to write on the coil? He is stored in the balls. Guys, are we really gonna stand here and talk like this like Patrick isn't dead? We had I the was, memorial I, service I, yesterday. It's time to move on. Yeah, oh. I buried him with my own hands. Oh, yes. The line's like, ringing. Oh. Patrick, this, that's, that's me. Hello? Uh, oh. Come here, give me my phone. <laughs> Oh, sorry, here you go. Jesus Christ, what a <laughs> weird invasion of privacy. Uh, sorry, hello? Inside Gaming. Yes, it's... hold on, let me put it on speakerphone. They said Inside Gaming. Oh yeah, that's us. That's all of us, okay. yeah, there we go. Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, go your, go for Inside Gaming. It's Santa Claus. Oh. <gasps> Santa <gasps> Claus? God. I have a very important... Number? I, I have everyone's phone number. Have you ever gotten an unsolicited dick pic from a number you didn't recognize? Yeah, with some white plumage of pubic Merry hair. Merry Christmas. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, 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 indeed. Wait, oh, Santa's Brett elf. Favre? That's awesome. <laughs> Inside up, Gaming, I have a very important task for you. I'm I, busy. <laughs> yeah, I think the elves were busy in the workshop making uh -huh. PS5s for all the good <gasps> children of the world. Ooh, but adults, but okay. No, it was just the kids. <laughs> okay. When at the last minute, a swarm of bots came into the North Pole, into the shop, mm -hmm. and have taken mm -hmm. it over, securing all the PS5s for themselves. Ripped from the day's headlines. Are you a fan, Santa? I was a fan of the old crew. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that doesn't surprise me. Yeah, okay. You're, You're the only gaming company that would take my call. Oh, oh <laughs> again, oh. that sounds about right. Dual Shockers yeah. didn't pick right. up. Yeah. No. <laughs> no idea. What about Video Game Chronicle? No. Kotaku? No. Uh, video Game Publication Again, Forks. no. Still no. To anything okay. you say, no. You are the last <laughs> number on the list. Buzzfeed Gaming. It's again. <laughs> <laughs> uh, no. Okay, so what, what do you need, what do you, what do you want? I what need you want to, to come to it. the North Pole and get rid of all these bots. I think I've heard enough. Bring. Bring. On Saturday, what is they it we're doing? Bring. Santa. Bots instead of weird people. Bring. Santa, Bring. are you there? Bring. Oh, no, Connor, hung Connor, hung Connor hung up on Santa. I got Santa back on the horn. Hang on. All right, go, oh, go okay. ahead. Okay, that's Zach. Okay, Amir, you want to get The connection must have dropped. I lost you there for a moment. I'm sending the Polar Express to pick you up. Oh, shit. oh my God! That's it. Is That's it all I had to say. <laughs> That's right, why I, I called those, back. Those, those old tracks. What behind the studio? You may each grab w one item for your desk. That's all you have time for from your mm. desk. Big coffee mug. Okay. Spider-Man walkie-talkie. Yeah. Okay. I'm gonna okay. take whatever that old broken statue that Alana has. That huge one. I'm just gonna take some Kleenex. I will take the uh, Cryo Freeze CBD tincture that we never did the sponsorship for, but they sent us anyways. Uh, I'm grabbing a, a can canister of G Fuel from the shelf behind oh. me. Right. <laughs> I hope everyone has their nicest mask. I'm gonna, I'm gonna head towards the train. We don't need masks where we're going. No, we always need masks. <laughs> Put your mask on, Zach. <laughs> the conductor steps out of the Polar Express and said, that's exactly right, Zach. There's no masks on this train. This is a train for patriots. <laughs> Jesus. Well, is there, there's no... <laughs> Come on then, masks oh, off. Does that mean well. we will not be getting hot chocolate vaccines too? Oh, there'll be hot chocolate. That oh, seems dangerous. Right. The but... COVID hoax is not welcome in the North Pole. Oh, no, 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 no. I brought no. my. This I train operates on 5G. Beard. I get on the train uh, and try to find a seat farthest from. Is there anyone else on the train? I'm gonna get on the train and I will take this seat farthest from Brian at this point. <laughs> the train starts to pull out of the station. Where, where, where are we going again? Is this a long journey? 
Or is this like a magical train? Not on the Polar Express. It's a magical train. Those Does it strange hurt? lights out in the distance, like that of a strange ocean liner, what would that be? The mills of Santa, the refinery at Santa's factory. <laughs> oh, I they provide him. petroleum to the entire West Coast. Yes. That's right. And because it's the North Pole, they don't have any restrictions whatsoever. It's just, they can just do anything they want. <laughs> yeah, right. it's free. It's, yeah. it's where freedom is. They just <laughs> opened it up for drilling, actually. <laughs> yeah. I feel like we're here to help Santa, but maybe there's a greater cause here. Let's save some America. America. The train okay. arrives, it pulls into the North Pole. And a, it's a, a bullet train, great infrastructure. The conductor comes over the intercom and says, <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, fellas. I seem to be having a bit of a light fever, a headache, diarrhea, and I've lost oh, all gosh. taste. But uh, anyway, we've just arrived at the North Pole. If everybody would disembark, I'll be at the bottom of the train to shake all your hands and thank you for riding the Polar Express. Thank you. I'm climbing I, out the. I'm gonna yeah, climb out the I'm window. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, I'm following Evan. Yeah, I'm also climbing out the window. Gonna just going out, out of the train. Yeah, I'm gonna go give him a hug. I hit him with the statue that I. <laughs> <laughs> you miss, but the conductor says, uh, "Honestly, I respect. I respect it." Uh, I respect someone taking the law into their own hands. Thank you, sir. That was part of an oath I took and intend to keep. <laughs> uh, the six of you are standing right on the border of what looks like it, it may have used to be the candy cane forest. It looks like there's been some pretty heavy deforestation in the last couple of years. But there are, you do see the smokestacks and the, the telltale signs of industry about you. Look at all those well-paying jobs. Spider-Man, I'm going to need some photos of all this progress. <laughs> Brian. Stop calling me. I don't know how you got this walkie-talkie. I have bigger things to worry about right now. For the last time, never. <laughs> I'm going to do a quick bump of G Fuel to get my blood flowing. You snort the G Fuel. It gives you just, you are filled. You're invigorated. You're filled with yes. energy. Uh, your heart my does feel like huge. it's maybe beating a little out of sync from normal. Um, but it, yeah. it is, for the moment, yeah, at least, you are, uh, you're amped up. You are psyched. You're ready to go. As the conductor Who pointed out, it? telltale signs of industry around here, but it also begs the question, where does all of the labor come from? Um, mm -hmm. Are these elves oh. conscripted? Are these elves is it like a Camino situation? And, and I think as we as we crest this facility Classic Camino situation. And, yeah. and see all of these these these, uh, these monoliths of industry, we have to ask ourselves what is inside each of these buildings? What is the beating heart of the industry of the North Pole? Alright, go ahead and roll that dice and see <laughs> yeah. if I can question the entire motive right. of the industry. Let's see. Uh, Zach, you fail to question the industry. That's awesome. A, again, Sorry. Blue Ignorance is bliss. Let's go, baby. <laughs> Inside Gaming is brought to you by HBO Max and Wonder Woman 1984. It's an all-new chapter in the Wonder Woman story. Wonder Woman 1984 finds Diana Prince living quietly among mortals in the 1980s, an era of excess, a world driven by the pursuit of having it all, an era completely different from where we last saw Diana. She's now come into her full powers, but maintains a low profile, curating ancient artifacts at the Smithsonian and performing superhero acts incognito. But now Diana will have to step directly into the spotlight and muster all her wisdom, strength, and courage in order to battle the cheetah and save mankind from a world of its own making, proving she is a hero for our time, for all time, for everyone. The film has a great story peppered with fun and humor, and even more of the intense, exciting Wonder Woman style action you love from the first film. It's full of heart, hope, little mystery, intense epic action scenes, and a few surprises. Everything you want in a Wonder Woman movie. Just like in the previous Wonder Woman film, there will be something for everyone to enjoy, but also a lot for our tried and true fans to love. The fate of the world once again on the line in a way you could never imagine, and only Wonder Woman can save it. It's in theaters and on HBO Max at WonderWomanFilm.com on December 25th. Again, HBO Max in the U.S. only and at no extra cost to subscribers. So go to WonderWomanFilm.com to check out Wonder Woman 1984 on HBO Max or in theaters in the U.S. only on December 25th. Thank you for sponsoring today's show. I guess we should set off towards the Santa star, which everyone knows what hangs low in the north sky and points towards Santa. It's, it's, it's or workshop. we can go to the place that says, you know, Santa's workshop. We get to start there. Oh, That's yeah. also good. <laughs> Either yeah. one. I didn't. Well, yeah. I didn't see that. So, I mean, anyone <laughs> well, could have missed that. <laughs> Someone from the behind kind of <gasps> a, the stump of a candy cane. Ooh. Hey, inside gaming. Oh, uh, you see before you, before you is a small, say, two foot tall uh, elf. Yeah. I squish it. I put it out of its misery. <laughs> oh God, I'm in. It's dead. You you step on him, but he's not small enough to like. Oh, to you make him very uncomfortable, and you're like, now yeah, he's what just if, kind of what if we all step on him? 
No, I was just going to grab Amir's shoulder and pull him aside and say, like, you know that there's no anti-extradition laws in the North Pole. <laughs> you, yeah, you, you might want to reconsider. I'll control my temper then. I would um, like to ask the elf if they're allowed to unionize and un- under what conditions were, did they get this job? Uh, the elf says, what's a union? Okay. First, I, first red flag <laughs> appears. Okay, I, would so like, I would like to ask the elf to move the plot along for us, please. The elf says, well, yes. I don't know much about plots, but I can tell you uh, what's going on here at this... Uh, Warehouse. Fantastic! Are you land? You're inside gaming. You're inside gaming, right? The ones that Santa yeah, hired. Yeah, that's us. To, we, to are, we are. Christmas we are gaming. inside uh, gaming. TM registered gamers. trademark copyright. Yes. Yeah. My name is uh, Tring Tringles. Hi, uh, hi Tringles. It's nice hey. to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Hello, Lovely. Tringles. I shake, to meet you, Tringles. I shake the tip of his little hat where it has where a hand. <laughs> Santa sent me down here to uh, get you guys kind of uh, well equipped and. To help you out with whatever you need to get in there and get rid of all these bots. Yeah. Well, I was just you, about to ask, I are you like going to supply us with arms? Yeah, I, we can talk about that. I, I may have someone. <laughs> that, I may let have let someone give who us the other option. Tringle, is this like one of those islands in the Pacific where it's legal to kill people? It absolutely is just like <laughs> yeah. Santa is so very, very clear that he will not bend the knee to any foreign governments. <laughs> <laughs> well, what's what, Tringle? What do you got? I can take you to a guy who will give you. Who can set you up? Okay. okay. <laughs> All right. Let's All do right. that then. Let's Who's do this that. guy? Uh, he leads you to a nearby shack. There's signs everywhere that say <laughs> private property. Keep out. I didn't know there were so many rusted out cars in the North Pole. <laughs> <laughs> the elf steps out and says, what the f*** you want? Get guns. Got my property. Hey. Weaponry. I say, oh, hey, guns. we're inside gaming. I got this. Hello, fellow patriot. Here's the problem. Uh, <laughs> we have a hotbed of communists in the factories. They're talking about unionizing. We need to blow it to hell. What do you got for us? Oh, well, why, didn't like you just, well. why didn't you just say so? Right this way, <laughs> brother. You, man. <laughs> hell yeah. He leads you into uh, his shack, and it is wall to wall firearms but they're all sort of like Christmassy, you know it's like a peppermint oh, okay. egg. it's like a peppermint okay. ak uh, okay okay, okay. Yeah. that kind of i get thing. it all right go ahead just take whatever you want i got more coming all the time Hell what's, yeah, your, what's what's your name my name chris <laughs> <laughs> what's, your last, what's your last name it's just chris. It's chris so i take the rpg with the silencer on it i well, take it the, the chestnuts universe. roasting on the open flamethrower that's what i'm taking i'm going to take a, a some roman candles that are uh three of them purple and one pink and in and, and they're in a little wreath carrying case uh just because i think that they, they've taken too much of christ out of christmas yeah. i'm gonna go ahead and grab uh grab the um 45 pistol that is conspicuously the only one that is not holiday themed and has a uh, desert print digital camo. And he a, says, uh, hey, hang on a second. That one is mine from Desert Storm. I thought I saw a fellow veteran. <laughs> in, in that case, I'll just I'll just take the I'll just take the 1911 with, uh, with uh, holiday print and silencer. I'm gonna take the ho ho homemade improvised explosive device. <laughs> Brian, I didn't know you served. Well, I don't like to talk about it. You know, I don't like to. <laughs> I okay. don't want to steal, steal any valor. It's just, you know, we've worked <laughs> together for a couple of years now. It, I'm going to take a minigun that looks like a Christmas tree. It shoots glass ornaments or whatever. Perfect. And then we very specifically say Merry Christmas to you as we leave. <laughs> yes. 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 Happy holidays. Of it. Yep. You know, yes. we could really use your help down south. Our country is being taken yeah. from us. <laughs> <laughs> Somehow it keeps just getting worse. <laughs> so I, I take a few steps back. I get down on my knee and I fire it directly at the door, completely ob- obliterating it, it's destroyed. It's Through the smoke, you, you first you hear the metal clanking of robots. Of bots, okay. in okay. this case, yeah. sorry. And you start to see them kind of spill through the door. Uh, I start spinning up my, my Christmas tree minigun and it starts spinning around, but nothing happens because it's got to it's got it's it, take up. It takes some time to charge you have to, you have to believe for it to work. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Also, yeah. yeah, so it's really like, <laughs> And that's that's the real Christmas story here. Spirit. Is Evan is Evan finding his love for Christmas again? <laughs> Somewhere far away, a group of strangers is sitting in Central Park singing a Christmas tune, and Evan's little meter on his minigun starts cranking. <laughs> yeah, it's, like, it's powered, yeah, by, it's powered by the Christmas spirit. Oh, then you, I'm just gonna start unloading okay. right now. Okay, oh, yeah. uh, you no, just go. You, right. Just go. You melt them into uh, okay. slag and fantastic. Heap of, this is great. Uh, raw so essentially, iron. with you and Evan working together, what we have is a, a dragon's breath of lead and flame. It's <laughs> what the season is really about. Yeah. yeah. I'm sorry. I... 
<laughs> it's just really touching. I've right. just surrounded myself with buried IEDs, <laughs> and I'm just taunting the robots to come at me. Ready and to I die. Have, yeah. And I don't have a shirt on. They do so. They, <laughs> they come sprinting towards you or rolling or whatever, uh, and just walking straight into it. It's just absolute carnage. Excuse <laughs> me. I just lit a cigar off a flaming robot. The bulk of the robots outside of the sort of complex are are cleared out. So you, you kind of have a clear path to the sort of like the main building, the office, if you will. Okay. Yeah. Inside, you. You, hear, you hear kind of a sinister, oh, oh, oh. Uh-oh. Uh, out comes what looks to be Santa, except with a hideous robotic face. And from inside the office, you hear, help me inside gaming. I look past Mecha Claus and I see Santa. And in what state is he? Is uh, he okay? He is, is gagged. He- with a, he has a ball gag again. How he spoke around it. That's that speaks to some real. He's in the dexterity. sovereign state of of the North Pole. <laughs> I would like to do an action. I would like to take my my big coffee cup and I would like to throw it at actual Santa. You do so and it, it hits him. <laughs> Are you? <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> Why would you do I'm this? Out. That's for that's that for not hurt. giving me Majora's mask when oh, I asked for okay. it. Uh, so, okay. Uh, yeah. Yeah. You just <laughs> weren't very good that year. <laughs> All right, Robot Santa says, "Enough of this." Oh, inside gaming. What are you doing here? Yeah. That's a great event. question. Uh, what are any of us doing? <laughs> Talking yeah, in the We're event. we're <laughs> all of us who came here on the Polar Express here because you you and your bots are making it so gamers can't get the next gamers and myself uh, as is established on the channel can't get the consoles they want and and we will not stand for that. And we're also all probably COVID positive, so we might have to hang out for a couple of weeks. <laughs> oh, ho, ho, Connor, did you ever consider that by reselling these PS5s, you're actually providing Christmas <laughs> presents for <laughs> others? Oh, uh, that is a tough one, Santa Claus. Oh, wow. Oh, 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 I'm kind of on his side now. A moral conundrum. It mm-hmm. turns out you're the bad guys. <laughs> I, th- I think we gotta I, just let him slide. I'm comfortable with rationalizing my terrible actions, like yeah. a Santa. But you have fucked with a gamer now, and... <laughs> That's a really bad idea. Thanks. I have my finger hovering over over a tweet right now to say that you, Mecha Claus, are in the pocket of Sony. Wait, wait. Don't <laughs> also, do the that. ultimate <laughs> weapon. That, that you aren't paying these bots any wages at all. You're just taking all the money for yourself. So oh. ho, 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 mother trucker. And then I hang on. And into my Christmas tree. I'm day. sending death threats yeah. to your programmer, Mecha. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Social media. <laughs> uh, robot Santa looks down at his phone, which has begun beeping uncontrollably. Yes. He checks it and says, Oh, no! There's death threats coming in from gamers all over the world. How did this happen? What have you done? I told you, you don't fuck with a gamer. I think there's only one person that can kill Mecha Santa. And that's Santa himself. That's Ganic Santa. Quick, Evan, believe again. (laughs) We we all have to sing to to bring Evan's Christmas cheer back. Sing something that won't get us a cheer. We built this city. We built this city on fire. Come on, you're not all singing. Evan, Evan's gun, Evan's gun fully charges, fully charges. Santa now freed thanks to the Evan's surgeon-like use of a Christmas cheer-powered minigun. Yes. Uh, comes up yes. behind the robot Santa bullets. and grabs him by the throat, which he then just crushes in one hand. That's tight as hell. I start crying, it's so beautiful. Santa looks at all of you and says, Ho, ho, ho. Thank you, Inside Gaming. Even though you were my very last choice for all the hundreds, thousands, even millions of gaming channels on the internet, you Count were me. dead last, yet somehow you've you have saved you don't, you don't Christmas. Get okay. Here's a okay. PS5, and he hands you all a free PS5. <laughs> one to share. Yes, one oh one PS5. One, to one share. single PS5. No, you all get a, one PS5 Santa gives you all a PS5. I to just share. opened the box though, and there's a note inside that inside that says this item is not really in your cart. And should I talk oh, to someone? Oh, <laughs> oh, and Santa oh, disappears on the wind. It doesn't give us a ride home, so we're stuck. Yeah, we're like, wait, how do we get back? Oh my god, there's one under my seat. Oh my god, he did it. Uh, just kidding. It's an old mini centipede. Uh, wow. Well, Studio. we should isolate here anyway and see yeah. if maybe we can uh, help, sure. make sure that we yeah. help them re- we can help them rebuild. 
Yeah, we've got a lot to do here, I think. We at least need to notify next of kin. I'm going to go hang out with Chris. Does anyone want to come with me? No, no, absolutely not. No, I'm going to go uh, hit the bar. I'm going to try and rebuild the bots and take over the North Pole later. That's smart. smart. Spider-Man, I'm going to need a new back out of here. (laughs) Patrick, please end this. Wait, I just got a text. Patrick's gonna pull through. Oh it's my a, God, it's a, a Christmas, Christmas miracle. miracle. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Our belief. <laughs> 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 <laughs>